So on Tuesday, I almost tried to get myself fired. Let me explain. Now I'm going to relate this story to the title in a second and what the video was about. But basically over on Tuesday, I work as a security guard at JFK and on that day, I had accidentally bumped into a lady pretty hard. Um, I just got on break so I just wanted to run, get some food and just not be bothered by anybody. I was walking really fast and I bumped into a lady and she got pretty upset. She told me to watch where I was going and I saw this moment as an opportunity. So the woman who was very, very upset, I was like, okay, this is my chance to finally get out this job. Um, so I told her where to actually go to actually complain about me specifically. I told her I apologize, but if you would like to complain, which I think you should, here is the location of my office and you can go talk to them. Then she had a completely change of heart. She says, oh, I understand. It's okay. I don't want to complain. I see that you're trying to take uh, uh, um, the responsibility for your actions and I forgive you, so I'm not going to complain. I know that's pretty stupid of me to actually do that. But the reason why in my head I thought it was a good idea because I thought this was finally an opportunity to go back to YouTube full time like I used to do. Um, for you guys who have obviously noticed, I don't really post this channel uh, much anymore. It's been like two weeks since my last upload. And the reason is I just, I don't have time for YouTube anymore. And that hurts to say. Um, my life right now, I, I do work full time at the airport, like I said. I'm working on getting all these other licenses, my gun license, uh, my uh, armed security guard license, and I'm working on my driver's license, which yes, I still don't have. I'm 23. I figured it's time I, learn how, I should learn how to drive. I'm going to be going back to school um, to study film. I want to be a, a cameraman obviously because you know i want to chase youtube somehow so i guess going to film school to get good with the camera is a good way to do that um so i have so many things going on in my life i have my friends i have everything going on and i i just don't have time for youtube anymore um i've been doing youtube since like what 2015 2014 um i believe that's when it all started, but I actually wanted to make YouTube videos way before my first upload. And when I first started this, you can easily see my content was shit, my quality on the channel was shit, and you can slowly see me rising up um, to the point where I'm at now where I feel my quality is actually pretty decent. YouTube will always be a big part of my life. Um, you know, back when I didn't have a job, I actually earned money from YouTube. Back when I didn't have any friends because I wasn't the greatest uh, student in high school and I was sent to a different school to get my credits up so I didn't really have anybody to talk to. You guys were the people I talked to. Um, back when I was in the worst stages of my life, going through the depression, going through all the anger I was feeling, YouTube was an outlet. It distracted me and I put a lot of work into my videos uploading every single day and I, I escaped from that dark place I was in. Um, there's something I actually would like to show you guys, um, uh, back when I first actually started, uh, making money off YouTube, I kept my very first YouTube check, I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but, um, this is actually the first check I've ever gotten from YouTube, and I know YouTube is not supposed to be about the money, but this is a huge factor, I'm not even sure if I'm supposed to be showing you this, it's from a contract that ended, like, two years ago from Maker Studios, but... Um, this check I earned $105 and I figured YouTube was the perfect job. I had people to talk to. I was making so many friends than I already had and I was making money off this platform. Uh, I don't even know what else to say. Um, I never thought I'd be making a video like this. I've always thought YouTube was going to be someplace I can always, always do. No matter what I was doing in my life, I can always create YouTube videos. But the type of videos I like to create take a lot of time. And with YouTube's new algorithm and how YouTube is actually um, ran in terms of recommendations that you have to be uploading consistently, which wasn't a problem for me because I was uploading full time because, you know, I didn't have a job. I didn't have anything going on back then except for YouTube. And... So that wasn't a problem with me. 
uploading every single day was easy. I put hours of um, work, I put like five hours a day into a video and then put it out there. I wouldn't complain that I was taking so long. I was just proud of what I was uh, achieving on this channel. Um, from Metal Gear to uh, uh, Street Fighter to Smash Bros to Resident Evil to kind of The Last of Us. I had to delete a lot of videos from The Last of Us. Um, to God of War, you know, I've covered so many games on this channel in the span of, you know, 2015 to 2018, which is like three years. I've, I've been thinking about, you know, just turning my channel to a streaming channel, um, but I can only stream like three days a week. Um, so maybe I'll move over to Twitch and build that up, even though that is super hard to build up. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna close this video by saying thank you, you know, like... Uh, just thank you for watching my channel. Thank you for helping me get up to 10,000 subscribers, which was my number one goal starting this YouTube thing. You know, thanks for helping me actually earn money in some type of way. Uh, thanks for continuously asking me where's the videos because that shows me that you care and that I have responsibility to put out content for you guys and not just me, not for my own enjoyment, but for you. Um, thanks for the, uh, uh, I think it was like 10 developers who've actually reached out to me watching my videos. Thank you guys as well for making the games that you create. Um, thank you guys for um, watching my theory videos, which is my favorite type of videos to make for every single game that I've covered on this channel. I love making theories because it was a chance for me to explore my own creativity. Just thank you for everything you guys provided for me. Um, I will be, if I ever do get fired from my job, um, I will be coming back to YouTube full time. That's why I have for now in the title. Um, because if there's ever a point in my life when I lose something because life constantly changes whether we like it or not. So if I'm at a point where I'm no longer doing stuff and I have a lot of free time again, I will always come back to YouTube. Um, but for now, I'm going to have to say goodbye to you guys. My final deuces. I, I've never thought the day would come where I have to make this video. And I also want to talk about why I want to do this YouTube thing. Mainly because I don't have, uh, how should I say this without being emo? <laughs> I don't have a lot of friends anymore. You know, most of my friends, you know, they're all busy. They all have their own things in their life. Most of them are in college right now, where I'm going to go into September. 